Good morning guys, what is up? Welcome back to another vlog and it feels so nice to say that we are finally back from Covid, from our 10 day quarantine, it's finally over and we're back and we're going to get trained again so yeah, there's probably the most boring 10 days of my life if I'm being honest um, obviously just having to stay in my apartment not ideal when it's been Christmas and stuff um, but today is the 26th and it's actually my first day I'm allowed out again which yeah so I'm looking forward to it um, as you can tell it's currently like seven o'clock still pitch black so I'm not up any earlier and um, but we are off to the Astro um, to get in a football session T today's session I won't be going hundred percent because even though I've been training all the training sessions have been like upstairs and it hasn't been as intense as I've wanted because it's just not as easy to do stuff upstairs. So today's session, I'm not going to go 100%. I'm not going to go like a madman. I want to get in a good session, but I don't want to kill myself being my first proper session back. And I just want to build up little bit by little bit. So yeah, in terms of how I'm feeling, I'm feeling perfect now. I've not had any symptoms for the last like four or five days which is pretty ideal um so yeah then five days has probably been the worst though because before that i was actually ill so i couldn't do anything last four or five days i felt good and i just had to stay inside which personally i think is a bit stupid that you have to wait 10 days even if you feel fine but that's the rules so yeah that is what it is anyway but yeah as i said we're off to the astro now i'm gonna get in a good session this morning Annoyingly, the gym is actually closed today, so even though I can go back, I'm, the gym's closed because it's 26th, so everything's basically closed here. But it does mean that the Astro, no one's going to check on it today because it's going to be completely closed all day. So what I'll be able to do is get in a decent long session, I think, at the Astro. I think I'll be able to go, honestly, I think I'll be able to go as long as I want, but I'll go until around half, half eight, nine-ish, I think, just to be safe. So yeah, I'm going to get down the Astro now. Enough chit-chat. I'll talk to you a little bit more about how I'm training to recover and if there's any like impact on me that COVID's had. But yeah, I'm going to get on with the session now. So I will catch you um, down at the Astro.
session finished and overall we're all happy with the session in terms of how like felt with like my breathing and stuff completely fine to be honest um so good news is like covid literally hasn't had an impact on me at all because i feel just as i did before and as you saw training session went really well um and it's so nice because it's like quarter past night now it's so nice having like unlimited time on there where you don't have to be worried about someone coming on so i was able to get in then drill as you saw and then also at the end do like a switch and drill where I open up the two seven side goals and it was just pinging the ball side so i've worked on that long ping basically just to work on it again overall perfect session to get back into the groove of things but we're not finished there for today and uh, obviously the gym's closed so we're gonna have to get a workout in upstairs this afternoon isn't ideal but it's better than nothing because what i've been doing the last few days anyway so yeah i'm gonna get a session in upstairs probably around two three o'clock this afternoon so yeah that is going to be the other training session for today and i might also go for a run depending on how i'm feeling but i don't want to kill myself off straight away but i am feeling pretty good so yeah that's the plan for the day i'm now going to get home though and i'll catch you in a bit so time is now just gone 11 o'clock actually so i got back had my breakfast and then then just chilled out for a bit but now we are actually going to get the workout all ready for the day um because i thought well i might as well just get it all done now and then just have the rest of the day to chill out really and also this football on this afternoon is just boxing day so i wanted to watch that as well so then i'd be able to watch it and not have to know i've got to get another workout in so i'm gonna first be on the bike for 20 minutes getting a little bit of cardio then i'm gonna get in like a little strength circuit because i haven't got loads of stuff up here i've got a small barbell um, some 15 kilo dumbbells 20 kilo dumbbells a few kettlebells and that's around it so i'm gonna do a little like circuit just to get the condition so yeah that is the session i'm gonna get on with the bike stuff now and i will catch you once we're finished with the workout I'm actually going to finish there. So all I've done for 25 minutes on the bike, then four sets, five sets even of 40 push-ups, and then four sets of 15 ab rolls. I was going to get a workout up here, like a strength workout, but I don't think there's much point because the gym opens tomorrow. Um, so what I'm going to do is get a full body workout in tomorrow at the gym, as it's just a lot more productive than here. Because if I was to do a body workout here today. Tomorrow I probably won't be able to do much in the gym because I wouldn't do upper body again. My legs are still going to be tired because I had legs yesterday. So it makes more sense. Just do a little bit of like, just do some press, press ups and some ab rolls. So I'm okay to do a proper upper body gym session in the gym tomorrow where there's a lot more equipment, a lot more weights so I can actually get a proper session in. So yeah, I'm just going to be smart about it and finish here. But still got a good bit of stuff. So obviously on the bike and then the push-ups and the ab wheel, good a bit of cardio. So yeah, that is the session finished. Now what I'm gonna do though is stretch for like 20 minutes to half hour, just to really stretch out my muscles and make them feel a little bit better. Um, I probably won't show you because it's quite boring and then get a shower and stuff. And yeah, I will catch you in a bit. And lunch finished. So that was chili and rice. It was class. Um, it was just from dinner last night, so it's quite nice. We don't have to cook. Um, but yeah, I ate quite late, actually. So it's like nearly three o'clock now. So what I'm going to do now, obviously boxing down that, there's football on the TV. So I'll probably watch the Arsenal-Norwich game a little bit and just chill out for most of this afternoon, if I'm being honest. Um, so yeah, i am uh, probably watch that. Give you a little update of how the match is going now and then, because I am a bit of an Arsenal fan again. 
I said I'm going out on loan for the season, but Arsenal are doing all right now, so I'm sort of coming back to Arsenal as Chelsea are not doing it for me, so I'm sort of turning back to Arsenal at the moment. Could quickly change, though, depending on a few results. But yeah, at the moment, I would say I'm an Arsenal fan again. As I said, that can quickly change. So yeah, I'm going to watch that match in a little bit, and I'll catch you after. Okay, guys, so the time is now like 7 o'clock. As you can see, I'm out again. Basically, all I did this afternoon was watch the football. Arsenal picked up a massive 5-0 win against Norwich. Put us right in that top four. I'm a proper Arsenal fan at the moment because everything's going quite well. But now I'm actually going to the Metro to um, see my girlfriend. Um, so, yeah, that's basically been this afternoon. Then basically we'll get back and cook some dinner. So I will catch you in a bit. Hey guys, so it's actually now the next day and that is where I'm going to leave yesterday's vlog. So as you can see, we're getting back into everything, getting back into the training, uh, quarantine and stuff. So yeah, it's all looking pretty good. So as I said, that is where I'm going to leave this vlog. Um, I will be back vlogging more consistently. Um, so yeah, I will see you in the next vlog. Make sure you hit the like button. Also, subscribe if you haven't already. Until next time, take it easy and peace.